Hi guys, uh, just want to deal with uh, some people that are uh, claiming they're into God and saying parts of the Bible are, <coughs> are lies and whatnot. Um, they seem to use um, buzzwords just like the New Age do. They're coming out with like crystallised understanding. Uh, and that's very new age. That is. That's um, that's what they talk about. They they say it's crystallised understanding. Um, <clears throat> and some of the demons that have been posting stuff online uh, that are from Galactic Federation of Lucifer and Asherah Man um, have been using that word crystallised understanding and. Um, We've got this chap uh, that's got this other guy that was exposing the new age to start posting for him. So he mirrors all of his stuff, so he can't centralise what he was talking about in the first place about the new age. And the poor guy thinks it was this guy who was exposing the new age, and I thought, any time now, he's going to come in with his agenda, you're going to see something of what's going on. Now, as soon as you've got that little bit of space, uh, that little gap, that's all Satan wants, is that little gap where <clears throat> you can turn around and say, oh, that part of the Bible is like bull. That's all he wants. That's all he wants. And then he's got his foot in there. That's it. He's in then. But these, the scribes, the scribes, if they got one word wrong, they, re, they rewrote the whole thing all over again. They went from start to finish. Right, basically, he's saying... Um, or oh, how dare uh, you know God's people be accused of worshiping idols and such like? Well, yes, they do. Look at what happened with Moses. Yeah, I mean he got the stones; they were engraved by God's hand. Uh, it came back down again, and they'd all made these uh, images. Um, uh, they found as well the site where they were doing all this, and they've seen evidence. Um, so yes, there was there was a load of people that were God's people that went the wrong direction and served these gods of uh, gold and basically they were gods of nothing basically and Baal and things like that. There were people, there would have been people who were meant to be Christians that thought they'd get a better deal and go over the other side. Right? So yes, that is common knowledge. I'm tired of the lies coming through here, yeah? So yes, that did happen. So it's not, oh, how dare they accuse Christians of, you know, people did go astray like they do today. Um, you know, I mean, as I say, look at what happened to Moses. Um, <clears throat> there were giants still around in the time of Moses, and they would have had offspring. And by this time, there would have been like hundreds, if not thousands, of these uh, relatives of these giants. The six fingers, six toes, that was quite commonplace for them to have. And... Um, and uh, this guy is actually quoting that uh, fight that he had that Moses uh, got these guys together, and they were, you know, they were they were in a fight there. Yeah, well, apparently <laughs> they were from the place where these uh, giants were, so it's quite possible that they were descendants of the giants. They were, you know, because it's, it's talking about these giants that were giving them hassle. Yeah, so at the end of the day. <laughs> This guy's information is not biblical. It's his own counsel. Uh, if God's got it in now for Moses, and if Moses was just, you know, if it's just a load of, uh, ooh, ah, we've got something in Revelation that talks about Moses. Uh, Revelation 15. And uh, it's verse 2 to start with. Uh, and I saw, as it were, a sea of glass mingled with fire. Um, and them that had gotten a victory over the beast and over his image, and over his mark, and over the number of his name, stand on the sea of glass, having the harps of God. Uh, number three, and they sang the song of Moses, the servant of God, and the song of the Lamb, saying, Great and marvellous are thy works, Lord God Almighty. Just and true are thy, thy ways, uh, thou King of saints. Right, so at the end of the day, this is right in Revelation, this is like when everything's all sorted out, they sing the song of Moses. So if he's being ruled out, why are they singing the song of Moses? Yeah, at the end of the day, this is Revelation, this is 
This is talking about like when things are sorted out, they're going to be singing the song of Moses. Hmm, I see. So, I mean, there's a lot of this going on, and it's like, it's all this hoo-ha with men going by their own counsel instead of reading out of the Bible. 